All right. So you got the leads coming in. You got your, v, you got your VAs uh, researching all the houses that are coming up on all these different auction sites. How in the world do you have boots on the ground, eyes on the ground in all these different markets, taking a look at these houses to even know uh, what a close estimation of repairs would be that you need to do. Cause obviously you can't, you don't want to bid on a property uh, until you know uh, what kind of um, repairs you're looking at. Absolutely. And this is important. This is one of the most important things on how you develop these kind of relationships and these relationships end up blossoming and, and give you more deals throughout the, uh, throughout the years. I'll give you an example of it. So in Tucson, Arizona, there was an REO agent who I bought a bunch of properties through over the years from 2010 um, all the way through now. We still currently do. Um, basically, he saw I was a serious player in Tucson, Arizona. We wholesaled a bunch of them and then he would start to bring me deals and bring me leads and bring me properties. So he was my boots underground. And how that started was, you know, I just reached out to him initially after I was bidding on some properties. And this is what you need to do if you're entering any new market. You need to contact the realtor or the REO agent for that property if it's a bank owned property. Get some details. You're trying to get the BPO, which is the broker's price opinion of the property. And if you can get that, that'll tell you basically what they think the as is value is, the 30 day sale price, the 90 day sale price, the 120 day sale price. And they'll show comps on there. And that's like, that's gold. That's gold when you get that. Um, so you utilize that them for that. You also try to get additional pictures from them. And then you're trying to get what kind of repairs are needed. Cause they generally know, again, the utilities usually aren't on, but they know what repairs are needed. They know if the roof's leaking, they know if the air conditioner or heater looks really bad and looks like it needs replacing with the hot water heater. You know, they'll tell you if the kitchen needs replaced and the best referrals I get for contractors hands down is from these agents. These cook. And the big reason is these, these um, contractors that work for these agents get referrals and they get a lot of referrals. So they do not want to screw over these agents when they're giving them basically their market free marketing. So the, the guys that we've used from all the agent referrals have all been good. And I'm going to knock wood when I say that the ones that I've run into that have been bad are ones that I've picked on my own. Now, I've, I've also gotten great ones, but the best referrals from people who are there who have boots on the ground and have local people you know how to do those repairs. So we rely big time on the agents on these properties. If there is no agent, we use a company called BPO Photo Flow that'll go out there and take some pictures of the property. And if we have a lockbox, they can usually get inside, take some more pictures, and we kind of tell them what to look for. You know, take pictures of the exterior, make sure there's no cracks in the foundation, take a picture of the basement, the systems, make sure the HVAC's all right, hot water heater, kitchens and bathrooms are important. You know, anything that they notice cracks or issues with flooring, or whatever, anything off level, we want to know that kind of thing. If there's moisture in the basement, just so we know what we're in for. And they generally do a pretty good job and they're fairly inexpensive to utilize. And what's the name of that service one more time? That's BPO Photo Flow, like Brokers Price Opinion Photo Flow.com. And they do a real good job. And they're not in every market. So sometimes we actually have to reach out to other local agents and send them out there. And you know, we just pay them basically more or less to go out there and take some pictures for us and then tell them if we buy it, we're going to list it for you. We do offer that. And if, if we do buy it, we do end up listing it with them or help, having them help us sell the property if they know some investors. Thank you.